There we go. Fantastic. Right. I'm going to try this, guys, and see if we can get a better connection. We had connection problems earlier, and it was difficult. So what I'm going to do is see if this improves it as well, right? So we'll try our best on it, see how it goes, and let me know how it looks from your point of view. Yes, we'll press on just now and see what is what. You're watching Scotty McClue, the first lord of the internet. Hashtag Flutai, I say. This is it here for your edification and delight. Can you see that one there? Scotty McClue, first lord of the internet. Hashtag Flutai. Follow me on TikTok. Dinky do fantastic stuff. And we'll see what happens here. We'll see if we can get the connection improved for you and get everything going. Dinky do Kieran, lovely to have you with us. Good connection so far. Thanks, Kieran. Very much appreciated. I wanted to get it just right for you guys. But if there's a problem, we can move studios. We can do all sorts of things. Do not fear. Fantastic. But do let me know, please. There's the wonderful Maria Knight joining us. As Maria Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us now. Maria, I would suggest a night off tonight and you don't need to do a thing. Just sit back and enjoy it. So there were, what's your thoughts on the sad event of HRH Prince Philip dying? It was so sad. What do you think about it? Um, I'm following back what I would say to you about that, yes, of course it was sad when you lose somebody of Prince Philip's magnitude, uh, you know, a thoroughly decent human being. But I'll tell you what was interesting. He was nearly 100. <clears throat> now, you know, men in general don't tend to live much over 100. So, you know, I thought that was absolutely incredible. I was pretty chuffed with that. You know, do you remember Captain Sir Tom Moore? the gentleman that walked for the NHS at 100. You know, remarkable man. So there we are. Lovely to have you with us, and dinky do. Welcome, 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 I say. Nice to have everybody with us. Can you say hi to Molly, says Blonder. Yes, I can, Blonder. I could say hi to Molly, no problem at all. And a very warm welcome. I hope you've had a nice night. NMD doing anything interesting. So there we are. Fantastic. I have a friend named Hector, who was 101, and he was in DD. Absolutely incredible. My old managing director, I mean, my father passed away at uh, almost 74. But my old managing director, his father was a para in the Second World War. And I think he made, I think he made 101. He certainly made 100. Absolutely amazing. So there we go. Hello again, Scotty. Hello, Sean. Lovely to have you with us and dinky do. Hello, hello everybody. This is fantastic. You have no idea how amazing these lives are. There we are. Now, follow us as soon as you come on. Thank you, Andy, for following. Very much appreciated. That's it there, guys. All you need to do is tap the top left and away we go. How amazing is that? Hashtag flow time. Why do you say dinky do? Because that's my catchphrase, Billy Mac. That means is all well with you and the world. Yes, there we are. 29 years, 29 years in two weeks' time since we said, first said dinky do. <laughs> Justin from the Big Feed, dinky do. Now, uh, hold on a second. Right, smelly feet. You are a troll and you are toast. Bye-bye, smelly feet. There we are, blocked for life. So there we are. We're not having any of that nonsense on here. What do you think, Winston Churchill? Do you think of him as a hero or a racist? Um, well, no, I think you've got to put any thoughts of racism have to go into context. Yeah? And you'll not believe this, but, you know, just look at the whole thing slavery and everything throughout the world. So I think that for somebody who was born in 1874 at the height of Imperial Britain to be called a racist is actually wrong. Now, I know that a racist by today's standard, shocking, but we have changed. The world has changed. In those days, Guys like that, he was an aristocrat, he was 50% American, and he had freedom of speech. He could say what he liked, yeah? <clears throat> so there you are. So that's 
what you're dealing with. But I think as a man, he wasn't the nicest person in the world, but he was interesting, fascinating, very, very clever as a politician. I don't think we'll ever see such a manipulative politician. But my concern about Winston Churchill, he took no prisoners. He brooked no opposition. And